Athlete Spotlight brought to you by King Tire, Sue Hayden, and Carlock Nissan. I'm Zach Jones, sports director at WBUJ, and we're here at Trinity Peabody High School, home of the Golden Tide for National Student Athlete Day. All right, I'm here with Sam Driggers. And what college are you going to? Going to MTSU. All right, first, let me say, I'm a huge fan. Man, Appreciate I've been watching you play ball all year, all last year as well, man. So tell me, what is it about MTSU? Why did you choose them? Well, they, they wanted me for me, you know. A lot of schools care about height, weight, and everything, but they don't care about my height or weight. You know, I'm truly blessed to have a great coaching staff over there. And they just wanted me for me. All right, and when did football start for you? Because you, you were baller. Like, I mean, you really, I've seen you throw, I've seen you play some defense before. So when did it start for you? Well, it started, I'd say I was about in the third grade, so about nine years old. And when did you know, like, you know, I told you, I'm good. When, when did you know, like, I'm, I'm that good? Like, you know what I mean? Like, uh, I can do this. Like, I wouldn't say I was, like, that good or anything. <laughs> you know, I had really good teammates surrounded by me. You know, my offensive line always blocked for me. And, you know, my receivers always did a good job. So they made me look good. All right, and what is Sam Driggers' motivation, man? Well, what is it that drives you all those Friday nights, even now after the season? Like, what drives you every day, man? You know, my relationship with the Lord, you know, he really motivates me for everything. But, you know, not just him, my family, they always push me to be the best I can and my teammates. And so all of those people impact me to get ready and prepare. All right, before we get on camp, we were talking about the culture here at Peabody. So if you could, like, tell somebody, like, man, I don't know about Peabody, what would you tell them about the culture here? It's just a blessing to be here. You know, everyone, you know, whether it's the coaches, the teammates, students, teachers, we're all just one big family. And, you know, we all we care for each other and we're always backing up each other. What does it mean to be a student athlete? Because I believe you take care of your business on the field as well as in the classroom. What does it mean to you? It's, it's just really cool. You know, I, I love just getting prepared, you know, to work here, you know, practice. We got this beautiful indoor, it's amazing, you know, man. not a lot of people can say that. And so, just being able to practice there and the teachers, you know, you can stay for tutoring. They're always there to help you, you know, make sure you succeed for the future. So. And you made a lot of memories on the field, man. Is there one in particular that just sticks out to you? I know it's so many. Right? Yeah. You're looking at everything on the wall right now and happening here at the school. But like, is there one memory that sticks out? You know, we had the 44 game winning streak. That was really cool. But on the field, I'd either say just winning state, you know, back to back or um, against Mace in the past playoff game, you know, we had our, you know, the first play we scored on a touchdown for like 50 yards. And so that was a really cool just opening play to really experience that and just kind of get hyped up for that game. Right. And you said MTS, you wanted to win by height and all this because you can play. You know what I mean? So are there any goals once you get to the next level that you want to do, like when you get in there, get to the lineup or just get to work? I just really want to work, you know, prepare myself for, you know, how good it's going to be up there and how, you know, it's going to be a, really different level compared to here. And uh, I just really want to be the best team player I can be. And uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to it. And tell me, like, we talked about the field football. Well, now let's talk about inside Peabody hallways and whatnot. What you, what you going to miss most about that, man? Just the laughs and everything, you know, being with my buddies, just goofing off. But also, you know, being respectful in the classroom. But yeah, just being with the guys and everyone, just making good memories. And, and people look up to you. I know some people now, they look up to you and everything you're doing, man. Like I said, folks, you're doing amazing stuff. You really are. You're graduating high school, you're heading off to college or whatnot. What would be your advice to somebody trying to do the same thing? Always just work and stay dedicated. You know, you're going to go through ups and downs. And the ups are great, but you're going to hit those downs. And you're like, how do I prepare myself for this? Just keep grinding, keep working. and. You know, it's not over till it's over. All right, what is something about Sam Driggers? I want an exclusive right here that we, we don't know, that nobody else know. What not? Oh, uh, that's a that's a great question. <laughs> I, I suck at video games. You know, I love to play them, but I'm, I'm bad at it. I just like being with my buddies, but uh, nothing really exclusive. You know, I'm just me, and uh, that's just how I roll. So. All right, man, appreciate you. I appreciate you. you. Thank, Thank you. you, man. Thank you. Go do great, man. Celebrate National Student Athlete Day with WBBJ Jackson. With hard work and determination, you just can't lose. Special thanks to our sponsors, King Tire, Sue Hayden, and Carlock Nissan.